Hi guys, and welcome back to Honey and Lace Henley Hive. So today I'm going to show you how I keep track of my inventory in just a basic Excel spreadsheet. This is something that is fairly user friendly and I think just about everyone has Excel on their computer. So here's kind of a brief overview. I have a product column or a product number column, excuse me then what the style is and a description of the style. Beyond that, I keep track of the size and the date that I receive it in. I've blacked out a few of the columns for privacy reasons. That would be wholesale price, the retail price, price I sold it at, and then any profit that I made, the date it was sold, and the customer's name. And I keep track of the customer's names for my frequent purchasing customers so they get a benefit every 10 items they purchase from me they'll get a free item now beyond that i have these really cool little tabs that i put in and i'll show you how to do this that show me pictures of my items and all you do is insert a comment and then you make the background of the comment a picture and then you can see a picture of the item itself it's really handy and really <clears throat> really easy to do really cool now Let's, let me just show you how to do this in one second. Okay, so you insert a comment and you're gonna go up to the top, click format, comment, and click fill effects, picture, select, and then I, you know, go to where I keep my photos. And just give me one second. Almost got it. There we go. Here. There's a picture of it. Okay. Okay. And there it is. And then you just click on the lower corner and kind of drag it to get it to be the size that you want it to be. And don't worry, it hides itself neatly so you're not looking at it all the time until you scroll over it with your mouse. And then there it is. Ta-da! So you can easily see what piece it actually is and you can see that was really simple and easy anything on my excel spreadsheet that is grayed out means that it is sold and i no longer have it anything in white is available anything in orange is a giveaway so i mark if it was a freebie anything in purple are damaged out items the dark purple line is a damaged item i still have to file a claim for the light purple means it's done and then blue and green i use for Items that have been paid but haven't shipped and items that have shipped and I'm waiting to hear from the customer to make sure they've received it or um, I'm waiting on them to pick up. So that's how I keep track of my inventory. Pretty cool, right? Now as I'm closing this down, I want to take a moment to show you how I organize my photos. And if you're going to be selling online in any aspect, you're going to need to take nice photos of your, st your stuff. So this is how I do it. I have a file named Honey and Lace. And then I have that broken down into different things for my business, expenses, you name it, it's in there. Then I click on my photos and then in there is all the styles that we carry. And then I have one that is for like specifically my marketing materials. And then I have one that is for my current inventory and anything, any style I'm currently carrying would be in there. So it just makes it really quick for me to find what I'm looking for. From there, you can see I've clicked on a Marina Maxi. I can see, Right there, boom, all the styles that I currently carry in the Marina Maxi. And then I also have a few other things. I have style description cards and header cards, a few promotional things that apply to the Marina Maxi, but it's just really nice having it all super organized and ready to go at all times. And as I said, you're going to want to have this stuff organized so it's handy when you need it. All right, so that's it for now. Don't forget to subscribe. I hope that this was helpful. Like this video down below if you liked what you saw and don't forget to share it. I wanna teach everybody little tips and tricks. This is a community and I love all of you. And as always, don't forget to find yourself and be that. Bye guys.